Hello everyone, this is your Saturday evening CareQE.com webcast. Here's Chris Gilson with a quick look at the forecast. Tonight's going to be partly cloudy, cool conditions, a slight chance for a shower to the north. Temperatures will be on the warm side once again for your Sunday, but the big difference between today and your Sunday will be the winds. They'll be picking up blowing dust around in a high fire danger for tomorrow. A mix of sun and clouds for your Sunday. We'll see the sunshine for your Monday. Temperatures will stay on the warm side as we start the work week. The bad news is all the precipitation is going to stay to our north and southern Colorado, but the winds are going to stay strong for Monday and also into Tuesday. Temperatures drop off into the upper 50s in the metro by the middle of the week. Crystal. State police say they had to use force to stop a dangerous driver. Yesterday morning, state police say an Albuquerque police officer tried to pull over 42-year-old Gar Medina at a Flying J truck stop. Medina fled south on I-25 and turned onto State Road 314 in Las Lunas. Two state police officers caught up with Medina. After a short pursuit, officers used what's called a pit maneuver, hitting Medina's vehicle with their cruiser. Now that disabled Medina's car and he was arrested. Medina faces numerous charges, including aggravated DWI, aggravated fleeing and drug possession. He was wanted on several felony warrants in Bernalillo County. Maybe it's the rising gas prices that had one suspect looking for a cheaper way to ship his goods. Jawan Belcher was in court today on drug charges after police say he boarded a Greyhound bus with a suitcase full of pot. According to a criminal complaint, the marijuana was wrapped in seven different bundles. Belcher tried denying the luggage belonged to him, but an officer saw him bring it on board. Today, a judge told Belcher he would need a lot of money to get out of jail. Mr. Belcher, I'll go ahead and continue the bond at 2500 cash or surety. I'll set for a 10-day rule case. Thank you. Belcher told police he was traveling from Arizona to Ohio. Those plans will have to be on hold for now. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates. I'm Crystal Gutierrez. Thanks for logging on.